Hi, this is Far Starter, and this is a review of the SH figures coming on the game Zombie Gamer Level 10. So, this is the packaging, uh, a running theme for Gen. And uh, you have the figure right here, what it looks like on both sides, top and bottom, and then at the back, uh, poses for this figure. So, without further ado, let's open the box so I can tell you more about the figure inside. Kamen Rider Game Zombie Gamer Level 10 is another rider with a zombie or skeletal light armor theme. Highlights include broken goggles and white hair on the head, collar bones that move up and down, and the buggle driver. The driver has an A and B button and the cracking details on the screen. The trigger of the gashat can be removed as well from the transformation belt. This set has 10 extra hands and the Gashacon Sparrow. The Gashacon Sparrow is an arrow mode and splits into two for sickle form. These sickles are held by a white peg that is detached from either blade. Well, let's go through the articulation points for this figure. We have a head and neck joint right here. The head moves left to right. And then we have the collar bones that go up and down. The shoulder pads go in and out. We have 360 movement on the arms and these cups right here uh, also on the other side goes in and out and then upper bicep swivel, uh, a wrist joint right here, upper torso and waist articulation and then leg movement moving front and back uh, better than Kamarada X8 and then the legs spread until this way and then we have double jointed knees an ankle joint right here and a toe joint right there so uh overall i do like the figure um it has a good representation of uh the zombie gamer level 10 and it has a really nice uh paint applications and the mash between black and white is really superb uh the t details are very good especially the broken glass here on the eye and uh the uh, bug visor right here and also the chest area right here and at the back as well so many details that you are you can be um, at all on and uh, that's all that you need to know about Kamen Rider game L gamer level zombie gamer level 10 the figure itself is what I expect to be. There are slight hindrances in the movement but these are just minimal. What is surprising is how the legs and feet are stable enough to do almost improbable bends while making it stand on its own without further support. What I didn't like is the arrow form that has a white peg because it doesn't hold both blades that much. In fact, during my review, the sides keep on falling off and I had to use another spiral from a different set in order for me to move forward with the review. And that is my review of the SH Figure Arts Kamen Rider Game Zombie Gamer Level 10. If you want to know the possibilities for this figure, do check out the photos at the end of the video. And don't forget to like, share this video, and subscribe to the channel for more toy reviews.